given up some of the space, and now they want to fight back into it. Fortimentus is already taking care of Kesnet, which is a big kill to take care of, and Mazina's not going to be able to come out with the guild, get on the board. Harper could be huge. No, he goes down. They're just taking the sight. The guild is holding strong. So impressive. Given all of the misdirection that was before them, Safe gets three, not able to get the last, but Leo does. Goes down, Mazina with the flank all the way in. Well, Kesnet down to 17 HP. That's Trex. Gets three. It's a high ground! TP away. And all of a sudden, they have nobody coming through long to pitch with Leo. But they have to send. They fully send as Leo gets three left in the round. I guess in the plant, though. Oh, what a play! They oh, like he tries to go in, he tries to go insane! And he's not able to do it. Klaus falls. Delzik just dropped the molly. Kesnit trying to find some space, but no, Cross holds him back. It's just too much. And they get the gunfight that they were looking for, perhaps a bit more, and they bargained for, though. Positioning, refusing to give up an inch. Just at the very end, Nax was able to find one with the Operator, now Leo pushing his way forward. He hit on the other side, the satchel in his lap, but the kill comes through anyway. Leo gets another, Leo with three! Trek has no money, and yeah, he still has the two satchels, and you go right up top! He does. And Cruz still have the numbers advantage. Perhaps Leo can find something. And oh my gosh, he does. He finds the back of Mazzino's head. Leo gets another. It's all down to Kesnit. And I don't think there's any way in. Now the Trailblazer know. spots everything. I know there's an op on the other oh, side. Oh, dead. Yeah. For this to be how they potentially lose the round, Safe has to throw it in Ruby 2 now. Oh. And swing, he hears that. The Molly in his lap. It may not be new, but it is fast, it is aggressive, and it has, at least for now, failed. It did this so often against Loud in the last game, so it's no surprise to see Gil prepped up. One kill comes through from Kevin Go Dish if they want. The one with the Sheriff. How much more can he find? His track still playing up top the satchel. Try to deal with the ball The crew might take the space, and it might... Oh, they always took the box! Oh, but the first one, the... the Shot goes wide, he's not able to land the nose. You gotta mix it in, right? Yeah. Sure. Talk about mixing it in. Look at how much space, how much, how many kills they've already been able to get. Kills are just able to bully crew. And the aggression, they tried throwing kills away. Oh, they pushed him inside this orbital strike, though. Uh, I've lost count. That was a showstopper in an orbital strike, too. And now Nags with the operator by himself. It's hard to spot, but comes from the other side. He knows him. Trying to pluck Trex back pocket. They look to take a lot. For them to decide if that's what they want to do. And of course, it's Leo who's poop walking his way out. <laughs> Still haven't seen a kill other than the one we just saw. It feels like these players have peaked this angle for what seems like an eternity, and now the bodies start to fall. Or Trex is just going to take her down. Unexpected angle, and it's just not enough. He's going to start to save you were saying. You were saying. Trex, or excuse me, safe. He's already able to find two. His Mazzino, you see, was just trying to jump up into the smoke, trying to stay alive. Safe this week. Oh, a couple of shots. I thought we we're going to go to the back of the head, but no, it's the ace that comes through for safe. Oh, yeah, they have the trap set up, and they're punishing. And it seemed like the ultimate perhaps were going to be. Walls off tower. And he does get the kill, though, but the counter ults as well. Trex takes out Kesdin. This one before to try to extend the map, and doesn't get a shot at all. The bullets come through the volley at his feet. It's an abuse. Rex as well. The wall up! They're starting to counter it, but Gilder still able to find the kills. Mazzino. He's going to try to board up a wall of zone, and he does. Oh, but this is just a fight up on ropes. What on earth was that? A 1v1 here? Second wall goes up, and Mazzino is able to find the space that he needs to get right behind him. Now, Coldimento running, trying to find the space. Able to find one kill, not a second. 3v2 here in favor of Cruz. Delzik is on the tap. Gets it to half. He's there. And he can just stick it into 2v2. Oh my gosh, she swung it at just the right time to get the kill they needed to. Evan, as Kesson is still able to get the fourth, he's going to have to get one more. Safe in the 1v1, and Kesson is not going to get the defuse. Yeah, he's not going to get the ace either. The I'm actually really surprised that crew made it last as long as they have. Delzik with the sheriff trying to swing through. It's not it's a bit late though. You see Delzik waiting for the flank to come through and there were three coming that way and they're full steam ahead and they just overwhelm crew. He's gonna have to pull off some sort of miracle. Boyd has to give the space up. The rest comes back up, but they don't know! Oh my gosh, they're surprised! Now they know! Trex is able to get two! 
Mazzino tries to swing through the V2. 42 armor, 98 HP. Gets able to get one. They're gonna funnel in. And they don't know that Leo's there. They're able to find one. He gets away. And that is, that's as easy as it gets, man. The push button. They actually don't able to take the space, so Gil is gonna clean things up. Trex just runs through his own fragment. And that's another round on the board for Gil. They go. Hunter's Fury out. Mazzino still gets the spike down, and he walks right into it. Unfortunate circumstances there as Leo's gotten two. Russ is on the flank, and he gets one himself. 4v2 here in favor of Guild. Snags and Delzik have to do it on their own. Delzik not able to find it. Nags into 1v4. Tries to, but no. Nags not understanding, and Russ once again, he's there when they need him the most. He can't land the shots. And Krauss just gets dropped from up top. One round of overtime is not enough. We're dancing again. <laughs> Leo playing on the other side. And Bruce still hang on to the numbers advantage. In front opponents. Leo's looking for more. He spots him and gets him. A 1v1. For the win. 10 seconds left and safe. Safe drops him. Spike planted. And, and he's not able to pull it off. Russ, he's got to kill here on Kessler before and he gets it again. The flash, the swing up from the wall. Nothing from Klaus. It's just Nags and Delzik. Cold Demento on the half. He's just gonna stick it. He's gonna get it all the way through and Guild are gonna do it. Welcome to the knockout stage. Their first international showing for the youngsters in.